truly hard on you guys. I'm sorry. Truly, I am. But I did say, no exceptions. How's it going everyone, Daniel Halloween here once again for product review and this is a product that I am so excited to finally be reviewing. Um, I didn't actually think I'd ever own a prop like this uh, and to be perfectly honest with you, I absolutely love this prop. It is a barbed wire baseball bat prop. Now of course a lot of people would say that this is Lucille from The Walking Dead. Uh, at Spirit Halloween, it's just called Barbed Wire Bat. And uh, let me tell you what. <clears throat> this thing is awesome, okay? Um, you guys saw the intro video, kind of. Not the intro video to product review, but the intro video I did with this bat. And, uh, man, I just, I've loved this thing ever since I bought it. Uh, it was, I believe, around $25, and I fell in love with it instantly. It's made of hard foam, um, and so what I'll do is I'll bring it up to you guys. That's the end of it. Um, you can see kind of this rustic paint job. Um, you have the black mark here. Um, a lot of good detail when it comes to uh, kind of like an old bat. And then, of course, you come up here to the barbed wire and I think it's sculpted pretty good. That's the end there. So yeah, barbed wire baseball bat. And um, yeah, this is a great prop. Um, I definitely would use it for uh, film like I did before. Uh, or if I'm doing a Halloween haunt, like my yard haunt. Um, I, I don't think I'd go full force with it because I, I wouldn't want it to break. Um, but it does look really cool. It's very intimidating looking um, when you get to the fact of, you know, it looks quite real. Um, I will say <clears throat> a, a down that I have for this would be where they painted the barbed wire black. And you have a lot of this black paint, like right up here, all black paint. And... Obviously, you know, when they're trying to, you know, get these things ready to order, um, you know, they got to make a whole bunch, they got to paint a whole bunch of them. Obviously, they can't be as as perfect as they may want to be. Um, so what my plan is, and what I'll probably do is make another review way down the road, um, I'd like to kind of redo this bat a little bit, um, take my time and kind of paint all the black marks um, on the bat, and then maybe... Um, paint more of a silvery color for the barbed wire maybe leave some of the black for the shadow and stuff but and then of course add some trusty perma blood uh to it <clears throat> to kind of create that you know used gross effect i think this is an absolutely amazing amazing prop for halloween i think spirit halloween did a great job i know trick-or-treat studios has one um, i'm not sure what it looks like so what i'll do is while i'm editing this I will look for another one from Trick or Treat Studios and I'll put the picture right here. And, um, you know, I'm sure Trick or Treat Studios is just as good if, I mean, it might be a little bit better, but we'll, we'll find out. But I think that for the everyday haunter, I think this is really good. I do know that, um, fellow YouTubers, Zombie Go Boom, I'll put their logo right up there and uh, I'll put a description for their, uh, YouTube channel in the comment, uh, in the description. Um, they actually are selling real barbed wire baseball bats, which I believe they're calling Barbara. But I'm shh. Um, so, I mean, these things are really popular. Um, obviously, those who read the Walking Dead comics knew about Lucille, a barbed wire baseball bat, for a long time. People like me who didn't read the comments, uh, the comments, wow, the, com the comics, wow, 
the comics, um, I, I didn't know that this was such a thing. And I'll tell you what, it just adds this badass effect to this prop. And everyone knows it's very recognizable in today's society. And, you know, people go, oh, that's Lucille. That's Lucille. So I think this is really cool. Spirit Halloween did a great job. So my rating for this, all in all, um, I'm going to go 9.5 out of 10. And the reason I say that is the only thing that brings it down a little bit is the is the kind of messy paint job for the barbed wire. But other than that, it's a fantastic prop. So guys, for Cemetery Creations, I am Danny Halloween. There's my rating once again, 9.5. Make sure to, let's see if I can do this right this time. No, I need to be over here. Do I? No, I need to be over here. Like, share, subscribe, and follow us everywhere on social media. All right, guys, once again, I am Dan Halloween, and remember, stay creepy. I said stay creepy, you need to go. Seriously, you, you need to, you need to go. I've had enough, I've had a long day. All right.